this tree right here has this dragon scale like bark and it's very very shaggy and it's very loose and that's very very particular distinction of this kind of tree also this is an alternating tree and if you look way up into the canopy it has very thin thin twigs that will be branched outside and it very classically also has this splitting point at the bottom too um, it will either do that or it will just grow up straight as one but it goes out this particular one and has the shaggy bark and the thin twigs and this is called black cherry tree and those ones classically will also have a dried out branch that will be sticking out and they call those widow makers in the forestry industry and those ones are very dangerous and it's always good to look up and around those cherry trees um, to see if there's any widow makers going on because they do have some large branches as well up there and they'll dry out and they will fall down to the ground at any unpredictable moment <gasps> and yeah it's good to be very aware of very very important as well as you can see right beside here some of us know these trees very well it's got this white papery bark um, that's that's usually a good given and a great tree that we have in Canada called the white birch there are a few different kinds of birch trees as well how can we tell from those different kinds of birch trees there's a yellow birch and a silver birch that I know of uh, the yellow birch has a grayer and almost yellowy golden tinge to the bark as it grows older. When it's younger, there's difference in the speckle that's on the bark, which is these tiny little dots that are on the bark. And there'll be a difference in the amount of these speckles that are on the branches that you would have to look at, or a younger species. Uh, there's a flock of, a murder of crows that are all about <laughs> That's a good segment right there. Yeah. <laughs> ah, yes, the new trees. Ah, we haven't gotten into the buds. Ah, that other tree that I was munching at would be a great one for bud distinguishing. 